<sighs> so excited. So today we are throwing it back to Fearless and we're gonna go back to one of my old favorites. It's called You're Not Sorry. And it's this sad, dramatic, beautiful song, just full of emotions. All this time I was I really love this song. It's uh, really a piano-centric song, but we're gonna play it on the guitar. Really easy song, it's super repetitive. Also, before I forget to mention, we are doing Taylor Swift Tuesdays. It's a new series on my channel where every single Tuesday I am uploading a new Taylor Swift guitar tutorial from any album, any era of Taylor Swift, and sometimes it might be a cover, but usually it's it's gonna be a guitar tutorial. So leave your request down below and we'll see what ends up being the next Taylor Tuesday guitar tutorial. So to play this song, you're first off going to want to make sure that your guitar is just tuned up because that's always a great place to start. I promise you, start there. You'll be starting with success. Next, you're gonna wanna place your capo here on the fourth fret for this tutorial. And we are just using four chords that just repeat throughout the entire song over and over and over and over. So we're gonna go ahead and hop into a close up and check out those chords. Our first chord is a B minor. Then we have a G major. A D major. And an A major. So now that we have our chords down, we're gonna go ahead and go over strumming patterns. So I really just have three patterns for you guys. The first one is just a simple down strum, just like that. This is gonna occur really in the bridge and there might be like a few other places, maybe like the outro. Um, and you can actually use down strums throughout like the verse if you want to, it's very dramatic. Um, you can go like, all this time I was wasting hoping you would come around. You could even match up the piano, like the pace of the piano, because you'll hit like on the piano if you're playing it, you'll hit the chords twice, be like, do, 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 do. You know, if you hear the song, if you listen to the song, you can hear that. So it's like, some really easy options that you can do, but I'm gonna go ahead and take you guys into the second strumming pattern that can be used in the verse, and it's more of a down, 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 up, down, 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 up. It kind of fills in those gaps a little bit more, if that's what you're going for. So we'll just mute the strings, you know, chord here, so it's just down, 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 up, down, 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 up. Try it with me. Now into our third pattern, this is gonna be used in the chorus. So this is just a, uh, we'll use the chord here so I can show you guys. So it's, you don't have to call anymore. I won't pick up the phone. So it's a down, 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 up. So without chords, it's gonna sound like down, 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 down. So I'm gonna take that a little bit slower. So we have down, 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 up. One, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, and. So those are just a few of some examples that you can use to play in the song, but just remember that you can be as creative as you want to be, and if you don't like using these strumming patterns, if you want to do something completely different, if you want to, if you'd rather like pick the chords, you could go, all this time I was wasting hoping you would come around. I've given out chances every time I know you do is let me down. You could do that, and it's also very dramatic and beautiful, so put your own twist on it, have fun, but we are just gonna go ahead and run through the entire song. Chances 
Cause every time I know you do is let me down And it's taken me this long, baby, but I figured you out And you think it will be fine, yeah, but not this time around You don't have to call Sorry by Taylor Swift. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Leave your Taylor Swift requests down below, whether it is from Red, Fearless, her debut album, 1989, Speak Now, or Reputation, or anything in between. Let me know what you guys want to learn next, and maybe it will be in the next tutorial. But I want to thank you guys so much for hanging out, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!